How to fix the floating head. Very easy. Let's delete our animation in our sequencer and create a new animation. Go to Performer and export our animation as level sequence. Then open this new sequence. You can go to the camera. Right click on face and press bake animation sequence. Place it to any folder you want. And name it also as you want. You can close this sequencer. Press right click on our new created animation, retarget animation asset, duplicate and retarget. Here we choose RTG. On the left side we choose our face we created for performer. On the right side we choose our face from MetaHuman, then press retarget. Ok, we created new animation. Then go to our main sequencer, to our camera, and for our face choose this new animation we created right now. As you see, we still have an issue with the floating head. Let's fix it. Go to the first frame, select face, here choose Use Animation Blueprint and set a keyframe to the first frame. Then disable post process and also a keyframe on a first frame. Then find our animation blueprint, press Browse to Asset in Content Browser. Open it on the left bar. Press double click on Anim Graph, then one click to layer blend per bone, and in blend mode choose blend mask. Press click here, press gear, blend profiles, add blend mask. And name mask as you want. Then type head and write uh, 1. Now save. Here choose your mask. And again press save and compile. Now you can close this window. And for now everything is ok with our head. We see the rotation and facial expressions as well. In this video I'm gonna show you how to create and animate the same characters in Unreal Engine 5.